Bonjour à tous, welcome to Play Today. My name is Charlie and today three women is gonna cook my favorite dish, the bœuf bourguignon. I'm Jean. My name is Teresa, aka Freedom. My name is Samantha. He looks familiar, guys. You've been on a dating show before. Yes. I think it's F Boy Island. Oh no! Oh. This is all scripted. I know they kind of ruined my images because they wanted me to be one of the star of the show and I didn't want it. So it was it was kind of a bad experience. So you oh, went on he got scared. Oh, oh, poor oh. baby, because he seemed like a nice guy. <laughs> you know, reality TV yeah. be fake. Well, I come from a really small town. My hometown is Angers. I don't think you know it. It's like a postal card from the 17th century. I was not really a chef, I was a saucier. It's at the end when you have all the plate aligned on the table, you have to make them perfect seasoning, the sauce, clean it up and send it to the king. I want a woman who make me feel comfortable, who make me smile, who's simple, who's gonna talk to me about her childhood and not try to impress me for what she have. That's all I ask for. I'm from Northern Ontario, Northern Ontario, Canada, and my mom is from Trinidad, so I'm Caribbean and Canadian. Where I grew up, it was all French. I went to French school, went to French high school. Every restaurant had all French cooking. Secret for working single mom, crushed garlic, frozen, tastes the same. In a man, he definitely has to make me laugh. I'm really ambitious, I work really hard. So when I'm spending time with somebody that I'm potentially dating, I want to feel that relaxation, that ease. I made a Caribbean bœuf bourguignon. I borrowed my expertise from cooking curries and pilau, and then I added a touch of tamarind. I think too often people follow a recipe and they're not really paying attention. That happens in life. You're not really attentive and checking in with yourself. And you can be 10 years and you're like, oh, what is this relationship or what is this career? And yes, I am gonna be extra and say, all of that is in my dish. <laughs> this is my Caribbean bœuf bourguignon. It smells really good. Ooh, okay. You can smell the onion and the mushroom as well. But I wonder what he smells like. <laughs> <laughs> the person who made that plate is really meticulous Ooh. because it's really well yeah. organized. The quantity as well is not overflowing. Looks like Honk. he likes it. Yeah. He looks he like he's enjoying it. it. He looks like he's enjoying Look it. Him. Everything is well balanced. The spices, the, the wine infusion is great. The only thing is the beef stew is a little dry. I would have preferred mm. more tender. Well, she probably like active woman, maybe in charge of herself, taking like running a business. He's smart. Doing he's it smart. all. He's intuitive. He look fine. I know he's not gonna like my plate, but I still might text him because he's cute. <laughs> I mean, now that I know that he cooks. Yeah. Does he have any children? Is he, oh, does he have okay. any student loan debt? <laughs> I'm from Champaign, Illinois. My heritage is African-American and Creole. My granny, she always used to cook me Creole food when I was a kid because she was just so happy. She's like, I got a little Creole baby, my Creole baby. Today, I made oxtail bergendorf. Let this boil for a few minutes before I add the instant mashed potatoes. Don't tell nobody. So oxtail is very popular in, in the Caribbean, in the South, African people from the Sporia. That's one of like, it's like a soul food restaurant. So what I'm doing is basically combining different cultures, which I am. French cuisine, Creole cuisine, and also a little twist to California because I got that Snoop Dogg wine for you. Put my heart, my soul into this. I should put my, oh. Dang, this really is instant. I'm making a mess, I'm so sorry. This is my oxtail bourguignon. I think it looks delicious. It's like, what is this? He, he ain't never had that before. <laughs> well, as I can see, the plate is really well served and generous. There's a lot of sauce. I could hear him say sauce all day long, I swear. I think that person is really generous in I all I am sense. generous. Okay. I am. He's smart. He's smart. He's smart. He's smart. <laughs> I get somebody to shut off my back. He Aww. is right. He don't like it. Don't see. No, he don't. He don't like it. No, he's shaking his head. <laughs> well, to be honest, there's not a lot of meat on that piece. It's really chewy. And uh, I will say the meat is not cooked enough. Uh, it is this like a rubbing type of like texture who is not really uh, comfortable on the mouth. And the seasoning is kind of off as well. I do like appreciate the attention to bring something more cultural, but it doesn't click in all those memories that I have about this French But beef. it's new memories. Y'all mm. can make new memories like together. Like a fusion, <laughs> It's a yeah. fusion, like yeah. coming to America. Yeah. <laughs> I'm 
originally from Ashburn, Virginia, and I was introduced to French cooking through my grandma on my mom's side. My grandma grew up in Peru and she traveled all throughout the world, and that's where she picked up her love of French cooking. I made a fresh beef bourguignon, added lots of veggies. I added a lot of thyme too. True to my character. <laughs> Beautiful. Culinary Picasso. I'm looking for something different in a man. I'm looking for someone cultured. I think that's what I've been missing. This is the first time I've attempted to cook my grandma's dish on my own, and I did it. So that's why I'm even more proud of myself. All right, now that she's out, we're gonna garnish her. This is my fresh take of beef bourguignon. Oh, your plate looks nice. Oh, oh mine does? Yes. 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 It's good. It looks good as well. There's a lot of meat. Yeah. It's well structured. There's not uh, too much of a portion. No mashed potatoes on that plate, so it's gonna be mainly the beef bourguignon by himself. That's what I like as well. Wait. It means that the person goes to the essential. It's straightforward. It don't play around. Don't try to make some things. What do you think to... about that? Yes, mm -hmm. <laughs> I agree. Straight to it. I like it. That looks really good. Oh wow! Yeah, you can see he really likes it. Well cooked. Well seasoned. The meat is really tender. It's a tasty meal, it's a tasty plate. He likes it. Well, I think the person who made that dish uh, followed the rules, followed the recipes, uh, maybe someone more perfectionist. It brings a lot of confidence to be able to like just cook the principal dish without bringing any side. I think he's on point with the confidence though. I feel yeah. like you're really calm, like, you are you know? very direct. I am. <laughs> <laughs> I pride myself on being yeah. direct. It's not what I was expecting, but I really do enjoy that version. Okay. Well, ladies, first of all, I want to really thank you for the time you spent in the kitchen to cook for me today. I had a pleasure and I had a blast trying all your dish, but today my favorite dish was yours. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Right. Well, I would like to take you on a day to maybe one of my favorite French restaurants. I love that. Hey, je peux parler en français avec toi un petit peu? Mais quelle surprise, tu parles français? Oui, juste un petit peu. Eh bien, allons-y. No, but...